Hi, this is Scott. I'm Lisa, and this is Anya. And we want to wish Trucker Rudy and his family and all of his subscribers a very Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year. <laughs> Welcome back to another Trucker Rudy show. Yes, indeed, here we are. We are now leaving Steinbach. Yeah, we got us a very nice trip, so uh, we're gonna hammer down. Only thing is, we had to get a little bit of work done on the, on the truck this morning, which I knew. So that kind of delayed me a little bit at leaving early in the morning, but hey, here we are. Back at it again. And so what we did is we got the uh, we got the uh, air dryer filter changed. And that is a very important step in uh, being sure that your water and soot and oil or whatever gets separated from the uh, from the air so that way uh, you don't have any of that junk in your air so that way you have better brakes and all that good stuff and also if you separate the water to get the water out of there then uh, you don't have no problems with your uh, with your lines freezing like I had there just a uh, couple of days ago with my fan hop there, right? It wanted to keep freezing up, right? And so uh, that should stop now because I mean, I waited too long in my opinion to change that uh, air dryer filter. They recommend changing it every year, once a year. And it's been almost two years since I changed it. So it was definitely a must change. So we got all of that done. And we got the uh, any freeze filter changed and got a grease job done. So now we're ready to go and we got us a light load. So I'm very, very happy about this load. It's only like 9,000 pounds in the box. So uh, we're happy, happy, happy. And we're off to South Carolina. And we're supposed to be there Sunday the morning. But we got our work cut out for us, but that's all right. We'll make it. We'll make it. I think so anyways. We're just going to have to keep that left door closed and hammer down, hammer down. That's what we're going to have to do. So anyways, we'll, uh, we'll get out of here and then uh, we'll focus on driving. Well, we are doing that anyways, but uh, we'll continue on showing you what we can throughout today. All right, guys. We are finally across the border. There was a fairly long line up there at the border today. It took us half an hour to get through the border there today, but hey, we finally made it. Finally made it. And that's all that matters, right? I think so. Now it's hammer down, hammer down. We still have 1,673 miles to do. So we're going to have to work super hard this week. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the way it goes. Although I have heard that in Minnesota, they're apparently getting uh, snowed over there. They're getting snow. So we're going to have to be a little careful over there today, especially with the light load that we got. Only 9,000 pounds in the box. It's... Uh, a little bit iffy, you know, but hey, we're going to have to deal with it, and if we can't do it, we can't do it, we're just going to have to park it, right? There's no two ways about it, we can only do what we can do, if it gets too dangerous, you know me, I pull her over, call it a day, and we'll continue on the next day. 
and let's hope and pray that we will have good uh, road condition. They'll clean the road pretty good. Let's hope for that. Let's hope it ain't going to be too bad over there. I mean, if it's as cold as it is over here, it should just be like light snow, right? It shouldn't be wet, heavy slush and stuff like that. So we should be all right. But then again, you never know. You never know. That's right. We're going to try and see how far we can make it tonight. But my goal would be Black River or maybe even a little past Black River. We'll see if we make it that far. But that would be the ideal condition. Since we got to try and get it down to at least 1,200 miles for the next two days. That means we got another, well, 13, 14, 15, 16 460 miles to do yet. Yeah, well, we'll have to work hard. It's already 12. So, uh, yeah. We'll work hard and we'll make it happen, right? Welcome to Minnesota, guys. We have now entered Minnesota. Yeah, we're just giving her. I got me another 37 more miles to go. And then I'll meet up with a friend of mine there slash subscriber. Yeah, we've been wanting to meet up here for a good while. And since both of us need to take our half an hour break here, I decided, well, why not over there, right? That uh, is going to be the area where both of us are going to be there almost at the exact same time. We'll probably only be uh, about five minutes apart. So, hey, why not, you know? We'll stop in there and say hi to him and, you know, use the restroom and all that. Probably uh, have us a bite to eat there real quick. And then we'll be on our merry way again. Yes, indeed. That will be awesome, I think. And I'm going to have my cameras on, too. Yes, say yes, I will. Yeah, let's see if this uh, Minnesota scale will be open today. Mind you, it is Friday. It doesn't really feel like Friday to me. I don't know, for some odd reason, today to me feels like Saturday or something. Like, it just feels like today shouldn't be a working day. I don't know why. <laughs> but, you know, I'm so mixed up already with the days because I've been working just about every weekend now for the last who knows how long. And so, uh, but, you know, if we want to make money and get good miles and all that good stuff, you sometimes need to sacrifice, right? And that's what we are doing in order to get good miles, which we are getting right now. We are getting very, very good miles. No doubt in my mind. I am just very concerned about the snow warnings that we're getting up here in Minnesota and all that. So uh, I'm not too sure about that. I don't know how that's gonna go. Apparently it was snowing up there in Wisconsin when my uh, friend came through there. The one that I'm gonna be meeting up over here. So we'll see. And now the wind is sort of coming uh, from the north northeast a little bit. So kind of coming right across the highway. So oh well. Looks like that scale is open. Yeah them lights are flashing up there so we'll go ahead and go across the scale there and see what they're gonna tell us today I mean I'm light right so I got a really really light load so I'm only 9,000 pounds in the box so I don't think they're gonna want me to pull into the scale but then again you never know right they might still pull us in uh, but they might give us the bypass well, we have to go in anyways to uh, get the bypass, I guess you could say, but but uh, what I meant is they probably won't pull us on to the actual scale. They'll probably just let us bypass. So we'll keep an eye on it and see what they're going to tell us, right? It would be kind of nice just to bypass it all together, but oh well. Now yeah, look at that. Them lights are flashing. You can usually see them from a good distance away, especially when you know there is a scale, right? So 
Well, let's make our way in here and find out what they're going to tell us. Yeah. As soon as we get in there, they got a bit of a pre-scale, they call it. Where they can roughly see how heavy you are just by driving over these uh, pre-scale or whatever you want to call it. We're supposed to do 30 mile an hour and then uh, they'll be able to measure our weight. Right here they got the pre-scale they're going on. Looks like that other truck is getting the bypass lane and I guess we'll go find out and see what they will tell us. But. I mean, I, I would be surprised if they actually pull us in, but we'll find out here in a minute or two. So far, looking good. Yeah, we're getting the bypass. That's awesome. If you ever get turned on to the right lane, that means you're getting on to the scale. Mind you, they do have a scale on this side as well, but generally they pull you into the other side. I've never been pulled into this side, and so... Uh, Actually, I'm not even 100% sure if they actually have a scale there. No, it doesn't look like I thought they did, but I guess I'm wrong. But yeah, here we are. We're out of here. Bye-bye. Adios, their Minnesota scale. It's actually Moorhead scale. Bye-bye. We don't want nothing to do with you today. We just want to get out of here. Hammer down, hammer down. Go to more, uh, go to... Uh, exit 38 that's where we're going to meet up my buddy so let's make our way down there and see if he's there when we get there i think he's going to get there a few minutes after i do from talking on the phone with him it sounds like he's a few minutes behind you know or he will be there a few minutes after i'll get there but man that wind is really coming a, coming a highway across the highway so i can get my words right the wind is coming across the highway really, really strong today. I can just feel it coming through the door. But anyways, we'll make our way down there and find out, see if he's there, right? How's it going, buddy? Good. How are you? Oh, not too bad. She said you can only have water. Yeah, I'm right. <laughs> I don't think so. Why not? Because I said so. You said so? I said so. You said so, eh? Yeah. Oh. I gave her some money so she said she wouldn't listen to you. Nobody else. She said, I don't believe you. No? No. So, how's things going? Very good. How about you? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. You're looking good. I'm looking good? Really? Okay. Appreciate that. You're looking fine too? Thank you. Right. So, how's the road? Good. Yeah. yeah but, uh, it's almost going around. The further yeah. the way, easy go. Yeah. And uh, it's just snowing the way and everything. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you got me recording. Yes. What do you mean? <laughs> I can see the lights flashing. What here. light? There's a truck going by. What light are you talking about? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Anything else to drink? A beer? No. Uh, you gotta go down uh, I told him that. he could only have water. <laughs> <laughs> Don't listen to him, you know. I'm to a Pepsi for these or Coke. Coke? Yeah, thank you. Um, have like just a scoop, that's all. No, no. Having something else too. I ordered me the California burger. Oh really? Yeah, okay. I got it on this page. Here's another page. Mm -hmm. That's where they have burgers. And if you're interested in seeing what it looks like, it's right here. <laughs> you recorded that deal with this one. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> We're recording this, now you're recording it. Oh my gosh. No, it this is. this is actually what you see in that camera. Really? Yeah. yeah. No way. Yeah, see, I can turn it on and off from right here. No way. Yeah, see if I turn the camera. Oh, that. really? So, how do you do that? Um, it's a Wi Fi transmission. Oh, really? Yeah, it's got an app in there and then I can control so you it. So do, you download the app We're yeah, out here? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, you don't want to show it to me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. You can, you know, 
press there or if you want to take a picture so you have to take a picture oh really yeah okay so you just stop it for more that, that's that's for turning it on and off yeah, i can control all the settings and everything oh really yeah. oh wow that's really nice and what i like is i want to get one of those to myself um, yeah because you um i think you told me according to where um You got one camera facing you, and that yeah. must be where your CPS, right? Yeah. Attached to your where your CPS, yeah. facing you all the time. And that one there is usually facing out. outside. Yeah. So, but that one's still mobile. The other one is not. Yeah, the other one I can take it off too. Already? Yeah, like you see them little hooks there on the bottom there? Yeah, That's yeah. actually a frame that kind of. It has the hooks in the back there, and you just slide it in, and it oh, okay. locks Good. in place. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. Cool. Um, yeah. uh, I'm not sure. I want to get one of those things for Josh. As, um, I, every time I go to Calgary, I go to that camera oh, store. Oh, yeah, yeah, that has got the, the uh, thing camera on, the side, on the side. Sorry, I'm just talking about ah. it. I'm going to go for the, um, the wrap, uh, the buffalo chicken wrap. And what do you get with that? Uh, you get potato chips with it, fries, or made potatoes, dollar seventy nine extra. So you get baked potatoes or fries? Potatoes, baked potatoes, fries, or extra fries, or baked or hash browns or whatever. No, I'll get the potato. Yeah. yeah. Huh? Yeah. A what? Potato. Potato? Yeah. Baked okay. potato. Uh, baked. Baked. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, it's oh, you pick up my pop. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so I'll choke it back. Yeah, uh, yeah. So You anyway. can have only water anyway. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Well, this is cool. My first time on... No, oh, you record this um, when... Um, at the corner, yeah. yeah, 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 you record it. So, yeah, no one after you post that up there, yeah. no one will really ever call me. No, no, I guess I was too small at the time, even now, I don't, I'm too small, you know. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, no, that's how was the roads down there? Though? Was it all right? Or? Yeah, 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 well, now, nah, like you said, coming in with the way that I came up, I came up. Uh, yeah, but from Minneapolis this way, how was it? Oh, it's fine. The yeah. four, the four, the four system, the four thirty four five, <laughs> or the no, the four ninety four, I should say, mm -hmm. it was okay. But I'm not sure the six ninety four. Yeah, uh, well, yeah, yeah. So. You, know, you came from Iowa, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, I'm looking at the radar and it looks like it's just coming here right now. It's, there's a big system coming from South Dakota. Yeah. So, um, what you can tell, it's snowing right now. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. yeah. A little tiny bit. Yeah, a tiny bit. And well, not of course, some way when it's blowing, which I left my phone at there, like according to the bug, mm -hmm. uh, the weather bug. Mm -hmm. uh, it shows, um, gives you the weather alert mm -hmm. and tells you the wind, wind chill, and also the, um, the snowstorm. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, the internet is a little slow up here. Pretty. Okay. Yeah. For the most part. Of the, no, it's not. But yeah, it's uh, coming right over here right now as we speak. Eh? It's starting to load. Yeah, yeah, that's why I got it on my phone too. Yeah. yeah. See, you see, we're up there now. Uh, alerts if you push yeah. on that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it gives you uh, what's going on. Yeah. yeah. From now to Wind tomorrow. Windshield warning. And you know, it was snowstorms. Yeah. So. So it's going to be a cold one probably again if they're calling for windshield warnings and all that. Yeah. And you just have to be careful going. Uh, that way because yeah. um, yesterday I don't know if you saw it on in the news anywhere no and the 80, 80, 80 was closed yesterday you know in between Ohio and uh, Pennsylvania or New York oh really yeah, because there was a bunch of accidents oh really yeah oh, okay yeah so far you're not going that way no, no. 
Yeah. Well, I'm going in from Indy into Ohio a little bit though. Yeah, but at the south end, are you, or the north end? Like, uh, I'm going from Indianapolis to Ohio, like on I-70. On 70 so yeah. you're going to be in the middle. So you might be okay. Yeah, by now they might have it. Oh, I mean, I'll only come there tomorrow, right? So yeah. that's well, actually, day. no, you'll be driving like your grandpa, so yeah, you might get there till Sunday. <laughs> what can I say? What can I say? <laughs> oh, she's... Anyways, um, um, how's your uh, Android? That little plane, I don't see you flying around here. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's too cold. <laughs> uh, it's too cold. Yeah. I'll wait till I get maybe to South, Dakota, South Carolina or somewhere. It's nice and warm. Yeah. Hopefully, I have a little time over there and we'll fly it over there. Yeah. Oh, so that, yeah, the, like I said the before, the other roads are good. Um, the, there was one set you know, I have to go driving along there, and I can feel my tires, you know, oh, so yeah. it's pulling crap. Yeah. <laughs> so that just slowed down a bit. You know? Yeah, yeah, that's never, never a good idea. So, no. how, how long have you been driving now? With this company? No, no. Oh, I mean, all together? Yeah. Seven years. Seven years? Yeah. Okay. So yeah. you're just a rookie then? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> you're the rookie, not me. <laughs> well, I've been be? driving longer than you then. What, I've been here. Years? I've been here at Penners now for seven, just over seven. And so all together for yeah. 12 years now? No, no. I drove a year and two months for a big freight, so. So eight years. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little over eight years. Oh, there you go. And, um, and do you like it? Oh, yeah. yeah. Not, yeah. Cool. Sure. Yeah, it's I it. like it. Too, you know? I don't like going from company to company. No. But, uh, they, but if they don't treat me good, I can well, take a bite. Oh, yeah. yeah and, you know. If you don't want to take the crop, then you have to move, right? Yeah. If you don't want to. Like, I don't want to take the craft from Rudy, too, you know, that trucker. Who's that? That trucker Rudy? Trucker Rudy? Yeah. Never heard of him. <laughs> <laughs> you sure? Yeah. yeah. I never heard of him. Oh, yeah? Um, Is he a nice guy? What was it to tell him about him before? He looks good. Well, I lied about that. He just looked at it all. <laughs> so, so, uh, so this is where you come to all the time, or do you go to uh, Beachy mostly? Uh, to me, it doesn't really matter. Whenever I decide to stop, I just stop. Well, some people got their own favorite places. Yeah, well, I do kind of a little bit too, right? I mean, I like the other place there at exit 61 for breakfast. They got really good breakfast there that I like. <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if they speak of yeah, good breakfast. I've never, I don't remember ever eating breakfast here. Okay. Um, what's gonna, yeah. Every time I go by here, I see Penders in here. Yeah. Or the, the, or the beat chief, you yeah. know. Who, what, what company are you driving for now? Well, I'll show you the company when we go out. It's called Dark Core. Dark Core? Yeah, Dark Core. Oh, wow. Did yeah. forget your Coke. Yes, you yeah. did. I did. I realized that when I get over here, and there's only one Coke on the table instead of two. That's, that's okay. Anyways, we'll get to eating here, and then uh, I got me some California burgers. I don't know if we can eat both of them, but... We'll give it a shot. If not, we'll take one to Oh, go. he will. He will eat both of them. And if he doesn't, I'll make sure he will eat it. He'll, he'll, well, he'll want the other one, right? No, no, no. I'm just <laughs> throwing, just throwing it out his face, you know? Yeah. Hey, buddy, everybody. You know this guy? You should give him lots of credit for what he does for us. You yeah. Know, give him lots of credit. He's yeah. a good man. I like him very much. There you go. That's your truck, the blue one? Truck. That's your truck? Yeah. yeah. We want to find out who you work for yet. These people don't know. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice looking truck. That's a nice little truck. 
but lots of dirt on it. Yeah, it's got a little bit of dirt on there. Yeah, it's a dark car international. They're right down the street from Putnam Tower, Tower on Brookside. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, this, right next door. Nice. Um, yeah. So, yeah. I like my truck. It's, yeah. It's got some issues, but hey. What truck doesn't do that? That's know? right, yeah. <laughs> what know? truck doesn't have issues, yeah? Nobody know and everything, so. Yeah. Anyways, it was nice meeting with you, my friend. Thank you very much. Yeah, no and, problem. And, and um, everybody, just keep on running to, uh, ready to truck community here and give a thumbs up. He is a good man. All right, thanks. All right. Here we go, guys. We have just left that truck stop where we met up with Scott. His name is Scott, and uh, he's a subscriber of mine. Yeah, he's been subscribed to me uh, almost from the beginning since uh, I've been doing YouTube videos. Yep, he, uh, he's been on my videos before. And that was probably within the first six months of uh, me doing YouTube videos. So, uh, yeah, so he's a long time subscriber. We appreciate you, Scott, meeting up with us again. It's been a long time since we met up again last time. We only met up once before. And, and uh, like I said, that was probably about two years ago. And so it's been a long time coming till we met again, but hey. We finally got the chance to meet again and you'll probably uh, find that video if you go all the way back on my channel you might be able to find that video but uh, yeah he's a nice cool guy he likes driving truck and, and so uh, yeah anyways as you can see we have gotten a little bit of snow it's not slippery yet and as far as I can tell, it may look that way, but it actually isn't just yet. But it is on the verge of, I think, getting slippery. So uh, we're going to drive real careful today and try our best to get some good miles in. But uh, we can't make any promises. We, uh, we really can't. My goal for today would be to drive another 350 miles. But uh, that's no guarantee we're going to do that tonight because uh, the way the road conditions uh, might be, you never know. I ain't going to put nobody at risk, including myself. So, <clears throat> but yeah, we'll make our way towards Minneapolis. We're on uh, I-94 already in Minnesota, so... So yeah, we got a good ways to go yet, but uh, weather doesn't allow us to drive. We ain't driving, as you guys seen before. So I am afraid of this system a little bit, but uh, it's either face it or sit sit in the, in the storm for two days probably. And I don't really want to do that, so we're going to try our best to get through this. And, once we start heading south, we'll probably start running out of the system a little bit, so we should be okay. Probably tomorrow afternoon at least. <laughs> yeah. Alright guys, we are now in Wilson, Wisconsin. Yes, indeed we are. It's a little bit after 9 o'clock in the evening now, and we've been driving really hard. Yes, indeed we have, and it is snowing pretty good. Let me open up my window here. Now you can let me show you guys a little bit. I don't know if your camera is going to pick it up, but if you look over there, you can see how much snow we got in here, especially in a little bit, because there's quite a few tracks over there, right? So, uh, yeah. I went and fueled her up over here to make sure we got a full tank of fuel and all that good stuff and then I went and parked her over here and then I went and checked all my lights cleaned all my lights off the trailer lights were pretty covered from driving all in the snow and then I cleaned my tail lights on the truck and I realized like I had a burnt out light so I had to go ahead and change the light bulb or not the light bulb, the whole light right that's like a, a round light I went ahead and changed the whole thing so that way we got a light again so 
so yeah that's awesome i realized it right now and we got it done right away oh there's a truck coming in with the headlight burned out look at that yeah i got my uh camera or my phone's light over there so you guys can see me a little bit better but uh yeah that's what i mean like check your lights make sure all your lights are working otherwise uh the DOT might give you a hard time if your lights aren't working especially in this condition right so we always make sure we do that but uh yeah anyways we're parked for the night I already uh, drove forward and backed her up a little bit because i mean i've been here now probably for half an hour already since i fueled and then i backed her in over here i went and got my fuel receipt and i threw my garbage out there i went to the washroom and then i drove forward and backwards a little bit so that way my brakes shouldn't be freezing in the morning right so so yeah anyways we're done for today we appreciate you guys tuning in i know it wasn't much of a driving video but hey we still have a good video i believe so give it a big fat thumbs up if you liked it and share it yeah that's very important if you do thank you very much and we will see you right here tomorrow morning on the trucker rudy show so don't go nowhere we'll see you on the next one <laughs>